Hey guys, Brooke Santa here, a shyness breakthrough coach and singer, and Sam, my producer, has told me that he has brought in a special guest. Her name is Orchid, and she's going to talk to us about what it's like pursuing your dreams as a YouTube star. Um, I hadn't actually ever heard of her, but... He says that she's really well known, so let's go ahead and bring her on, Sam. Let's go ahead and bring her on, Sam. Whoa, wait. Sam, what is this? You, oh, you, this is, <laughs> uh, you're making me look like an idiot turn the oh my gosh all right this is orchid we're gonna ask her some questions today she's a famous YouTube star I'll link her I'll link her channel in the description box down below so orchid What is it like being a YouTube star? Did you always dream of being a YouTube star? What are your hopes and dreams for the future and how do you plan on getting to them? This is not working. Sam. Sam, you can't leave. Orchid here is a little camera shy. So I'm gonna just let her sit in front of the camera and talk to you a little bit about what it's been like pursuing my dreams on YouTube. So I started off with a passionate message in my heart and not knowing how to get it out. So, so I went ahead and started filming videos because I'm also shy and an introvert, or at least I used to be shy, I'm still an introvert, but YouTube was a way for me to get my message out there without having to break my little bubble without having my energy drained and a good starting point because I was so shy it was really hard to talk about these passionate things in my heart because I didn't want people to trample all over my passion and so YouTube making videos to put on YouTube was a pretty um, was a pretty good way to do that without having somebody be like you yeah, or stupid right in front of my face which yeah of course you still get some haters but like it's it's so different than facing your fears head-on so if you do have a passionate message on your heart I highly highly recommend I highly recommend starting making videos because making videos even if you put it on Facebook or wherever you put it making videos has been such a huge thing for me it has caused my confidence to boost and I actually started doing lives before I started doing videos but between live streaming and videos my confidence has increased and I've been able to convey my message in a different way than I would have if I never started doing videos and just such unique opportunities and I've had a lot of opportunities to travel and pursue some of some of my biggest dreams doing video so whatever your dream is it's possible and I highly recommend starting with video video is a great place to start or if you've already started with video let me know what you've already done or let me know in the comments down below what you are planning on doing. I am so interested and excited to hear what you have to say. Our guest star is going to leave now. Love you guys so much and as always, dream big.